but yeah, I mean, I think I'm honored uh, to be recognized, and I'm sure Jordan and Vincent both think the same thing. Uh, you know, it's a big honor. Uh, we were all working at the uh, first COVID testing clinic at Royal, uh, Royal Columbia Medical Clinic, and uh, it was being closed. And uh, there was going to be a large portion of the population, an area that we didn't have access to a local COVID testing or respiratory assessment clinic. So that's when we decided we needed to do something and we asked who in the clinic wanted to help out. I think like Vincent, me, Jordan, Ali were the main people that wanted to do, get something together. So Shortly after the move, we were wondering you know, what kind of numbers we'll get because it's obviously a different um, uh, geographic location from the previous site. And um, very shortly after we opened, I think our numbers were pretty high, both in terms of number of people being swabbed and number of positives, uh, but it also showed that we were able to um, um, achieve and help with the deed in the community. So I think that was pretty gratifying for me. And I would say like there was never an upset patient about waiting a long time or not you know, having trouble seeing us there, but I think every patient that we saw was always very grateful and thanking us and our staff for being there for them. Everyone kind of used, we were able to use each other's strengths to um, get through things that maybe I wouldn't be good at or Vincent would be great at and uh, Carlin would be good at another thing and we were able to come together and uh, make it work for a long time and um, yeah it was, it was quite amazing now that we look back at it how how we were able to basically as strangers come together and work together support each other be good friends yeah really honored to be nominated uh, I don't think I deserve the recognition because like I said lots of people probably would have done the same thing if they could have so yeah just to add on to that this is more than just a three-person team this is all of the MOAs, all the nurses, all the doctors, the community members, the division staff that kind of all came together to make this happen. So this is for everyone.